what's going on? It's Ash Jerk coming at you today in Raid Shadow Legends. I know what you were thinking. I want another Ash. No, no, I need another Ash Raid Shadow Legends shard opening video. I got you guys covered. I'm gonna enjoy it very, very much. We have a 10 times chance, meaning meaning basically I'm guaranteed not to get this champion because I never, ever, ever get the 10 time champion. But I'm always that sucker pulling these shards. Nonetheless, uh, we have Tawana Rock, really one of my most wanted legendary champions inside the game. I don't have a ton of void shards, so we're going to have to get really, really lucky today. Why do I love Tawana Rock, you ask? Increased defense, increased speed. That's great. That's great. But really... Remove two random debuffs from all allies at the start of each turn if they're under continuous heal. If not, one random debuff can be one of the strongest cleansers inside the entire game. Kind of a la Doom Priest on the uh, passive here. By the way, guys, standing desk first video. I have some freedom, man. I can do whatever I want over here. It feels kind of cool to have the space. I found out after the fact that health benefits to standing desks Kind of murky at best, kind of up in the air. I didn't know that when I bought one, but either way, I love kind of being a little bit more animated. Let me know what you guys think, AKA probably none of you guys care if I'm sitting or standing, but anyway, I shared that with you nonetheless. All right, guys, so I have 55 void shards. Let's open five, one at a time, and then we'll start doing them 10 at a, 10 at a time, right? So here we go. Uh, man, I, I mean, just no Harrier, please. Just no Harrier, please. We're gonna be doing $100, obviously, to help the uh, people of Ukraine. Uh, I will have a donation link if you guys are, uh, you know, feeling generous. Obviously, they need our help right now. Uh, so, range monger, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, okay, another rare, another blue. Uh, Abalaster, alright. One more, it's not gonna be legendary. <laughs> Good one. Okay, uh, yeah, I was right. I was trying to, like, reverse jinx myself. Didn't work out. Bulwark, okay. Alright, so we got all the duds out of the way. Here we go. Only 50 void shards. I say only in quotations. It's still a lot of money for these freaking void shards. But let's get that Tawana Rock, man. Let's let's get it. Give me a reason to jump around without a chair, man. <laughs> All right. Fanatic, Seducer, Cagebound, Ox, Armentine, Skeleton, Rock Beast, Fellhound times two. Okay, okay, okay. 40 to go. Boom. Bloodhorn. Okay. Hollow. All right. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, a bunch of blues. This is why, by the way, not a two times event here, guys. Not a two times, Warcaster, all right, whatever. Let's keep it moving here, keep it moving. All right, we're already down. Okay, to one Up in the air, I want you to jump. Shakar! <laughs> Hello. Shogger, I pulled back-to-back -back Shoggers. My last void, uh, void opening video, I pulled Shogger. I was a little bit more excited uh, because, well, now we have him, obviously. But hey, he's a really cool champion. I have built him. I haven't done a guide on the champion yet. Uh, let's go over his kit. I can't, mm, I can believe because I even called it these ten times. There's too many champions in the game now to make ten times even. A factor anymore of course obviously it's a factor but when you have hundreds and hundreds of legendary champions not quite that many in void man I thought I was gonna get so lucky I saw the legendary gold and I'm like this is it this is this is to want to rock I, it's gut and then don't cry don't cry don't cry shogger really cool champion all right sleep on the a1 aoe times two first hit poison for four turns second hit decrease defense three turns on a three turn cooldown pretty cool skill on the A3, attacks one enemy, then attacks another time at random. The target's under a poison. It's going to ignore shield block damage and unkillable. Grants an extra turn if the kit attack kills an enemy. Also resets the cooldown of Venom Storm if this attack kills two enemies. Well, that rarely happens. Uh, but here is the cool part of this champion's kit. It's Constant Agony. Instantly attacks enemies with the default skill whenever they receive damage from poison debuffs placed by this champion pretty cool stuff obviously he is aoe poison here on the a2 but and it does last four turns which is pretty cool on a three turn cooldown so ideally on these longer battles he's placing that poison he's attacking them all the time problem is is i i, I as much as i think this champion is really really cool 
like very very awesome i don't know where to put them as a value over replacement you know because even on hydra you know you know guys know how it is right like landing poisons on everybody and not have them cleanse right away or whatever is easier said than done However, I haven't tried enough. Like, I've only played around with him in a few different areas for maybe an hour or two. So I need more time. If you guys have any ideas, you let me know. Harrier? Whack. Get the heck out of here, man. All right, here we go. Ten more, guys. Let's do this. Let's do this. By the way, big shout out to Judo Slop. Sent me one of his hoodies. One of my favorite Clash of Clans content creators. Work with him uh, at, uh, at AMG, our company. Here we go. It's going to be Bellower. It's going to be... Uh, Bellower, Renegade, and Gear Grinder, and a bunch of meh, right? These are our last 10 guys. Maybe I'll pull a few uh, Ancients just for the heck of it. But let's see if we can get lucky here. Bellower, no. Daywalker, no. Malbranch, no. Stitch Beast, no. Ashwalker, even Ashwalker. No, man. Boom. It's, a, it's, a, it's, not a, it's, not a, it's not a void, is it? It's not a void legendary, guys. Man, I keep going for Tuwana Rock, and she just doesn't want to... She doesn't want to come to me, man. She doesn't She doesn't like me. She doesn't like me to want to rock. All right, here we go. Ten more uh, Ancients. Let's just fill them up with Ancients. Who cares? Maybe. Oh, God! Damn, it's going to be a long night. Yeah. Vasilius Ronas, he's not a ten top either. Uh, I said, damn, it's going to be a long night. Oh, my God. Come on, man. Dude. He's not a 10 time either, man. What is it? Bad El Kazar, Underfreeze Brogni, somebody else who's really good, and we get Basilius Ronis, who actually did get a big buff. He now has a guaranteed stun, a la Astralon, like 100% land and AoE stun here on his Magistry, uh, Majesty. His A3 ability on his A2 attack an enemy three times. Ignore de increased defense, shield, and block damage, as well as 50% of the target's defense. So, for me, I was really excited to build him. They did buff his multipliers. I will say that, unfortunately, they did not buff his multipliers enough. I still can't find a real justification to use him. Obviously, cool to have a guaranteed AoE stun. Force Affinity Legendary. It's nice they added a little bit of damage to his kit. But I tried him out, built him, and not super, super impressed. Especially this A2. You think an ability like this would just, like, kill anybody. And it's it, it's a hard hitting. I'll show the multipliers if I can, uh, but it's just not. It is over overall. I, I think he needed more damage or a little bit more to his kit. Even though an AOE stun is pretty cool. Anyway, that was cool to get another legendary, another hundred dollars ready for charity, right? All right, here we go, guys. Boom! Lightning round. Boom! Again, this is not a double chance. Oh! If I hear the music, I'm gonna dance. Don't try to stop me, I exist to remember your story I'll make a decision if I want some peace or if I want the glory, yeah Don't want a life that is complacent or possibly cold Wow, dude This is, this is so, so dirty pay to win, guys So dirty This is my sixth Mashal That's when you know you have a massive, massive, massive problem So, my sixth Mashal, meaning that I cannot uh, empower him, I can't do anything I guess he will become a life token. Uh, that's the first time I've had that happen, but two legendaries, not bad, man. My luck is pretty good. I mean, life token is cool. It'd be cool if they'd rotate those champions in the life tokens, but then again, you know, that probably affects like two people in the game, right? So like, maybe that's not the top priority for Raid Shadow Legends. I take it back, I take it back. What do you guys think? Do you think you should be able to pay gems to kind of rotate the champions? Obviously not every champion in the game is going to be there in the, you know, the life token shop. But do you guys think it'd be cool to add that ability? Maybe, you know, 100 gems? it have to be pretty pricey. But then you can rotate and find that champion that you really, really want. And then just save up for that champion when they're on the screen. Think that's a good idea or is it a foolish one? You guys let me know either way. I know you will in the comments below. Guys, that's going to wrap it for the... Actually, you know what? I lied. I'm gonna do something crazy right now. I have one more spot open for champions. Let's pull a sacred instead. Let's see if we can get $400 for charity in today's video. Boom. Boom! Okay. Hey, Ugo! Man, another thing I will say before I leave you guys 
is I wish, is this a mistake or is this a cool thing? You, you let me know. I wish you could empower epics, man. It'd be very, very cool to empower epics. So much easier to get duplicates of epics. Nothing, I shouldn't say nothing worse. It's not the end of the world, but you know, when you pull a dupe epic of one of your favorite epics in the game, like Ugo is to me, it's kind of like under, it's kind of like bittersweet. It's like, oh, I wish I could empower you or do something cool with you, Ugo number two, number three, number eight. Uh, but I can't. I guess we'll end the video on that note. Do you guys have any ideas? Let me know if so. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching all the way to the end of the video. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Send you positive vibes to those who need it. And as always, take care, guys.